I felt a little bit scared. It was very exciting. I liked all the different voices and uh, um, the approval of the audience. This project came about after a conversation between the Bach Choir outreach team and the Triborough Music Hub. Because the Bach Choir wanted to do a performance of Berlioz's Te Deum and a new work by Jonathan Dove, which needs a children's choir. So we started to audition children from all around the Triborough to find some fantastic singers who would be able to take on that musical challenge. It's a piece that's in Hebrew, so it's a language a lot of the children will not have heard before, so they've been practicing their Hebrew pronunciation. Um, and their ensemble skills as well, so that they can be heard at the back of the Royal Festival Hall. <laughs> Bella, Mama, eh. Bella, Mama, Bella, Mama, eh. Good. I wanted to sing with young singers because, first, it was like a good opportunity for me to like, expand my, my, um, my technique and my vocal range, and I love singing. When the Bach Choir came to our school, um, it was very amazing because um, they, they, they were listening um, um, to our suggestions and um, we, were li we were paying them back by listening to them sing. I'm actually looking forward to uh, singing in the festival hall. I've never sang in a big place, yeah. I wanted to join because I thought music would be my passion. Um, I thought that if I joined, if I joined um, the choir, it would be a great experience to um, sing. We're basically just singing down backwards, but we're putting a five in between every number. That's all we're doing, really, isn't it? One five four five three five two five one five four five three two one. One five four five three five two five one five four five three two one. Again. One five four five three five two five one five four five three two one. Good, that was better. When normally when we're singing Te Deum or any other song, sometimes the words are quite hard to pronounce because sometimes they have a on the end. It's like, yeah. Young Singers came into being as a result of us talking about the importance of an outreach programme, which has been going now for four years and very successfully. We've seen probably uh, over a thousand children in, in as part of this. And the Triborough Hub with whom we're working um, have been fantastically supportive of the Bach Choir and, and, and its work. And as a result of which now we have the young singers who are auditioned to be in the smaller choir. You have to bring them out of themselves and make them feel at ease and able to do their best and to engage them because it's really important. The wonderful thing about this um, programme that we're running at the moment with, with a wonderful Sarah who's taking them is that you know they're, they're singing wonderful music actually, they're singing great pieces, this new work by Jonathan Dove which is fantastic and of course a wonderful war horse in Berlioz's Te Deum. The challenges the children face in singing these works begin with the, the languages. Firstly, the Hebrew in the Jonathan Dove. The Latin will be for the Bellias. Um, but also then to learn what it is to be confident about their own part within those works. So increasing that confidence through the rehearsals. And so we're looking forward to seeing that develop over the coming weeks. Don't start here, but that means you do. Okay, with my left hand. Try it again.
My son is uh, in the Young Singers. He's singing uh, Burley Oats and he uh, absolutely loves it. My goddaughter is with the Dove Singers. I was, we we're quite impressed with all the, the singing she's been doing and she really does enjoy her music. My son's in the Burley Oats Choir. Um, the technical sort of exactness, if that's the right word, has sort of just really, um, I think, helped his confidence, yeah, made him really feel proud of what he's achieved. My son practices by Lewis and he's enjoying it and he ca he's looking forward to it every week. Uh, my daughter Julia, uh, she joined the Daft Choir and she absolutely loves it and um, she's looking forward to the performance in the Royal Festival Hall in June. I've done it. it was really great. It's one of the biggest concerts I've been in, and I, I honestly, I was quite scared. It's been the like um, a big experience for me to see what it's like to be a singer and like to be one of those popular people. I felt a little bit scared at first, and then after, I just went for it, and then I was surprised and proud of myself. It's been, it's been quite staggering when they were suddenly realising this huge wall of sound that they were a part of and sitting underneath the organ as well with that big sound. Um, but they took it in their stride, you know, by that stage they really, they really knew what was going on and it was very exciting for them. But um, one of the children came off stage and I heard him say, that was the most exciting thing I've ever done. So I thought, right, that's a good, that's a good enough quote for me. <laughs>